A driver on Long Island is facing DWI charges after ramming his vehicle into a nail salon, killing four people, including an off-duty NYPD officer. He remains in the hospital awaiting arraignment as the community grieves. Good days, Briella Tomasetti, live outside the nail salon in Deer Park, Long Island. With the latest, Briella, good morning. Robert and Deshani, yeah, good morning to both of you. A growing memorial sits here outside Hawaii Nail and Spa where people from this community have been coming over the past few days to drop off flowers, other mementos, and pay their respects. Uh, candlelight vigil is scheduled for tonight in memory of those four innocent victims who lost their lives in this completely senseless and avoidable tragedy. I'm in, I'm in total shock. I'm in disbelief. One Long Island community still reeling from the drunk driving crash that claimed four lives over the weekend. This gaping hole at Deer Park's Hawaii Nail Salon, another tragic reminder of a nightmare turned reality. They were very great people. One of the victims was off-duty NYPD officer Amelia Renhack, who lived in Deer Park and worked in the 102nd Precinct. The three others were employees, two women and a man, all from Queens. Nine more people were injured, including a 12-year-old girl. It's kind of scary to know that even the brick thing, the door, nothing prevented that type of accident from happening. According to Suffolk County Police, a Chevy Traverse driven by 64-year-old Stephen Schwally careened through the busy storefront on Friday afternoon. Cops say Schwally was speeding and drunk at the time of the crash. Almost all the way to the back of the salon, the vehicle traveled. Schwally was treated for non-life-threatening injuries at Good Samaritan Hospital in West Islip. So far, he's been charged with driving while intoxicated. Police tell us he'll be arraigned at a later date. Schwally was arrested and charged with another DUI back in 2013. He basically got a slap on the wrist for that one. He pleaded guilty and was sentenced to just three years probation. For now, we're live, though, here in Deer Park. Robert, back to you. Briella, thank you. It's